Alright, welcome everyone. This will be my first attempt at any sort of YouTube Let's Play, because it's something I've always wanted to do. <clears throat> but I've never been able to actually try it because of a whole bunch of... Mainly because I'm bad at talking about things. So, I have really have no other better game to try this with, so I'm just going to play Mountain Blade with Fire and Sword. The Mountain Blade series seems to be rather old. I mean, graphics-wise, it looks really old. Um, it's a really large open-world game, I guess. Basically, you run around in medieval times, or whatever time frame this one's set in, not entirely sure, and you build up an army and take over the world, shit like that. Or do whatever, really. And since I am a weakling, I generally choose the easy setting. Because I like to take my time and actually have fun with shit, and not necessarily have to deal with getting my ass kicked, even though this series is really hard and I tend to always get my ass kicked. Um, first, grenade throwing. There's grenades in this one. Alright, that's cool. Fucking... Just put one in all, because why not? Because I have no idea what the hell is going to happen. Let's get some looting. Because I like to steal shit. Um, inventory management. It's always a good thing. Prisoner management. And let's also... Is it first aid? Is it surgery? Each point is a chance to mortally... Okay, yeah, it's surgery. Oh, no. It's wound treatment. Alright. And now the weapons. In other versions of this game, I like to I like to use two-handed weapons, so... Ugh. I've never been good at fucking designing characters. I generally just go with the fucking youngest. That's a little crazy. Super sensitive. Um, super fucking sensitive camera thing here. What type of hair do I want? The luscious and longest hair ever. Because after all, I am a motherfucking princess. Yes, that, that, that right there is the perfect, it's the perfect amount, just perfect amount of hair. I'm gonna go with the braid, because I like the braid. And I'm not gonna deal with any of that shit, because I really can't be bothered. Too complicated, I'm probably never gonna see the person's face anyway. So, your travels have taken you to a small Cossack village on the outskirts of the wilderness. As you stroll past, the silence is broken by gunshots. Let's see what trouble is afoot. Probably gonna go into the game at this point. Yep. Welcome to With Fire and Sword. This is a short tutorial that will guide you through your first steps in the game. That fence is blocking your way. Knock it over. You can attack in four different directions. Move the mouse up, down, left, or right while clicking the left mouse button to execute an attack. Good. Now on to defending. Defense is controlled by the right mouse button. To defend effectively with a weapon, wait for your opponent to commence his attack, then hold down the right mouse button. If your timing is right, you will autom- That guy ahead looks like he's up to no good. You'd better use your new skills to teach him a lesson. Excellent. Adam. Looks like there's more fighting to be had. That group of adventurers seems to be expecting company. A group of adventurers. Hopefully they don't expect tiny company, because I don't seem to be the helpfulest person here. I did already knock a fucking guy unconscious. Oh, no, these are my helpers. Alright. Time to beat up some scoundrels. at least two of those guys. And my one-handed weapons improved just a tad. <clears throat> Thank you for aiding us. A an extra arm is always welcome in times such as these. Well, thank you, Jacques de Cle Clermont. Is that Clermont? I don't know. <clears throat> it was an honor to aid you. It was my honor to aid you. 
come. Let's find some horses and ride away before more of these scoundrels appear. Yep, let's get the fuck out. Yeah, just run right into the well. That's... Yep, that's per... There's a... There's a wall there. There's no... Alright then, we'll have to do something about this padlock. Take this old pistol and blast the wretched thing, will you? Great! Oh, you I have a new toy! Shit. Press R to switch to first person view. This will make aiming your pistol easier. To further enhance your aim, hold down shift. Grab yourself a horse and ride away with Monfort and his men. Get close enough to the horse until you see the word mount appear. Press F to mount up. that not Moe's. Alright, so the first one's fine. I was gonna let you guys get the first one. Sumpter? What the fuck is Sumpter? I have no idea what the fuck Sumpter is. Well, let's ride off Wonderful. the Wonderful! You're saddled up. Horses can be wily beasts. To control your mount, use the W, A, S, and D keys. Press W to spur the horse onward, and S to rein him in. A and D will rein the horse left and right. Riding requires some practice. Don't forget that it's easier to make tight turns if you slow down a bit. I mean, that's kind of... That's kind of logical at any sort of game that has any sort of movement. Look, more enemies on the horizon. Time to put your sword and pistol to use. You can scroll up with the mouse wheel to switch between your weapons. Now, go ahead and fight your way out with fire and sword. Out of naming this. I can hit him, I swear. Many thanks, stranger. These are strange times, as we both well know, and it's good to meet new friends. Would you care to join us for supper? Aye, that's I would. After defeating the final enemy, you return to talk with your new ally. My name is Jacques de Clamont. I can see you are surely no brigand. Come, unsaddle your steed and rest yourself by the fire. The supper is nigh ready. My name is Tara. How did you find yourself in these lands, sir? Where are you headed? Ah, oh, now we get options. I am Clermont's, Clermont's of Lagin Dock. Lagu Dock? Don't know. Our line descends from the famed crusader and Count Simon de Clermont. But unlike my magnificent ancestor, I have neither great titles nor vast lands. I served in guard of Cardinal Mazarine, Mazarin? Mazarin? I think it's Mazarin. And was doing well for myself. But then the devil made me his fool. And I challenged a certain DR... Diartagnan? Diartagnan? I don't know. Lieutenant of the Royal Musketeers to a duel, fully knowing my skill with saber and pistol alike. <clears throat> the guileful Gascoon thought to avoid the risk and convince the Queen that I secretly planned an attempt on the life of the young Louis. <clears throat> Thus, in the night on the duel's eve, I was forced to flee Paris, and now I am doomed to wander the fields of Europe. So apparently I'm in France, I guess. What would you advise I do from here? These are troubled times, and a mercenary, especially one that that has known command, is worth his weight in gold. Start with small jobs, I would say. Take your time to get accustomed and, and to understand the local affairs. Wipe out some bandits. Do some freelance jobs. Escort a merchant convoy or protect a village. After that, you might try enlisting with one of the rulers. You'll earn a reward. Maybe even get yourself an estate. Ooh, buildings! which, by turns, would also bring you some coin. Once you gather some loyal warriors and earn a name for yourself, you might lay siege to a stronghold, throw your backing behind a claimant to the throne, or even start a rebellion yourself. <sighs> Tell me, sir, what's happening in these lands? That's a lot of reading. I don't actually care. I'm not going to read that. It was a pleasure to meet you. I'm moving on now. I recommend that you the path to Zamoshai and take in the town. 
and Smolensk Smol is a fine city, I'm not far from here. Alright, I need to... Map and journal. Yeah, navigate around the map, look like select anything on the map, hold down the right, rotate, zoom, hover over the element to receive information, press Q to bring up the in-game log. Okay, it's simple. Ooh, ooh, are you following me? Because I'll take you the fuck down. Oh. <clears throat> this week's wage is one thaler. Total current wealth, a thousand. <clears throat> I don't have any men. I don't... Do I have men? What? Do I have to pay my horse? What the fuck? What? Wait, do I have to pay myself? Is that seriously something that happens? Do I have to pay myself some some wages? All right. So apparently, the, all the wages that I that I pay to myself every week is just kind of poof, gone, or shout out my ass or some shit. Polish Commonwealth. Oh, I went I went through it. Whoopsies. Alright. How about we talk to the mayor? That sounds like a good idea. Hello, stranger. You seem to be new to Smolensk. I am the mayor of the town. You could have a job for me. What are you looking at? Well, enough, I think I might have something you can do. We have had some fighting near the town lately with all the chaos that comes with it, and that's led some of our less upstanding locals to try and make their fortune by looting the shops and farms during the confusion. A lot of valuable goods were taken. Need someone to teach these bastards a lesson. Sound like you're gonna work? I'll do it. Rad. Okay, I need to go to the marketplace. Talk with the arms merchant. I know how that works. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got. So we have a lot of. So we have guns, large bag of bullets. Just got bullets. I wonder if I should get a lot of pistols or what kind of weapons I should get. Crack simple wheel lock musket. How much money do I have? 999. Alright. I'll get a large bag of bullets because that seems like an upgrade. Uh, 23 thrust, 22 swing. Tempered thrusting sword. Oh, it's got a reach. It's literally better than mine. Well, actually, no. I mean, it does 23 damage to thrust, but I can't swing it. Like, what's the point of a weapon if you can't fucking swing it? I can't even get that. Well. I guess that's what I'm getting. <laughs> have any better armor? Because right now, I have literally nothing. Sturdy beret. I get a hat. <laughs> I have four armor right now. Alright, alright. I really can't get much worse than that. Um, get some infantry gloves. I'll get a fucking better coat for myself. Uh, mine's fucking garbage. I'll buy myself a sturdy fucking beret. <laughs> it takes away my hair. <laughs> Alright, let's not have that one. Because my hair is fabulous. It still takes away my hair. Whatever. I don't give a shit. It's all hiding in the hat. That's how that's the logic we're gonna use. Because the fuck not. Because why the fuck not? Sturdy village boots or village boots? Let's get the sturdy ones. Alright, I did some upgrades. And now I'm leaving. Now where are these looters? 
creatures that I was told to take care of. I'm gonna break your legs. Nice and slow. Wow, such a violent word. Such violent words for someone so well dressed. Fucking charge their ass. A fancy fucking hat. Where are they? Whoopsies. Whoopsies. Of course, he's receiving damage. Ow. Let's just fucking surround them and then fire. <laughs> See what kind of shit I got. I got nothing. I do like axes though, so I'm gonna have that. Plus one one that's shit. Shit. It's all shit. I'll take it all just to sell it. I got the there again. Like, yo, I took care of them. Ah, oh, sorry, I made any progress to report. I killed some looters. Here's some 40 bucks. Ten dollars per kill. I scared saw the whole thing. That should make anyone else think twice before turning out law. The bounty was 40 thal thaler? Is it thaler? I'm not sure if that means. I hope it's thaler. I hope it's thaler. For every for every band, so that makes 30 and 40 in total. Here's your money, as promised. Is there anything else you need? Not yet, sir. Farewell. Look at my fancy fucking hat. <coughs> Well, I'm going to go and sell off that stuff that I bought, that I stole from those guys. It's gonna give me jack shit. 49. Whatever. If I can... Hmm. Oh, hey look, more looters. You better not be a manhunter. Oh yeah, I'm fucking manhunter. I'll fucking bring it. Fucking bring it! Sir, is this be a robbery? Clear? I'm not a sir. I ain't giving you one chance to hand over everything you got. My mate's knives be quite sharp, understand? Heh, <laughs> you don't scare me. You'd best be ready to taste steel. Or in this case, lead. Wait, were bullets back then made out of lead or steel? I have no idea. But I think this is going to be the last battle before I say no to this particular, um, particular episode, I guess. Well, I should have seen that coming. should have expected that miss. These things were wildly inaccurate. Yep, missed again. <laughs> okay, I found that funny. Fucking shot him point fucking blank in the face. I wonder how I should... I wonder how I should consist of my army. Because I finally get one. I want to say... Just a group of musketeers. Oh, you're running away? You're running away? I don't fucking think so. Oh, 
I missed. Maybe you will go with me. <laughs> Things are so fucking inaccurate. <laughs> oh, my chores will hit you. Alright, fucking third time's the charm. I shot him in the ass. <laughs> Alright, so with that, I am going to leave it there. Oh shit, I've been recording way too long. Whoopsies!